Due to Lumbia's deportation, there is heavy deployment at Turkish embassy in Kampala, Uganda. Hello, welcome, and thanks for taking your time joining us live on Projan Media TV that brings the latest news and the latest updates in the country and across the world. Kindly do one thing, subscribe and turn on the notification button for all these updates. There is a heavy security presence along the roads leading to the Turkish embassy on plot 9 at Prince Charles Drive in Kololo ahead of the deportation of popular Ugandan blogger Fred Kajuri, also known as Lumbuye. Reports from the Ugandan community in Turkey's capital, Istanbul, show that Turkish police arrested the blogger on Tuesday at the request of Ugandan authorities. Lumbuye has been a thorn to the Ugandan government because of endless criticism and different, uh, on different social media platforms. So on Friday evening, the Foreign Affairs Minister, Okelo Oriem, said the Turkish authorities would hang over the blogger to Ugandan security this morning at their embassy to face trial for inciting secretarianism using social media. Lumbuye's social media followers have been rallying each other to stage protests at the Turkish embassy in Kololo against what they called human rights abuse. Our reporters visited the Turkish embassy where he saw the heavy presence of officers from the police field force there. There is FFU military and local defense units. The officers had also deployed in other parts of Kololo backed with armored and patrol vehicles. The officers also turned away pedestrians and motorists and advised them to return and use other roads apart from Kololo Road. Last month, President Yoweri Museven asked security agencies to deal with Ugandans in foreign countries, posting fake news on social media that dents his image and that of the country. Security officials accused Lumbuye and several bloggers based in Europe for masterminding social media rumors about the purported death of President Yoweri Kaguta Museven. The spokesperson of the Criminal Investigations Directory, that is Charles Twine, explains that the government has plans of going through known protocols to arrest all Ugandans using social media to tarnish the country's image. Well, that is it for now. Thanks for watching Progen Media TV that brings the latest news and the latest updates in the country and across the world. Uh, uh, across the world. Therefore, do one thing, subscribe and turn on the notification button for all these updates.